All right, what's up, everybody? So now, I am back here. We're gonna go to the uh, design studio for Richmond American Homes, just located off of Blue Diamond and the 15. We're gonna meet a client. Uh, we're gonna help spec out the home. We're gonna do electrical, high, low voltage, and also we're gonna take a look at some cosmetics, floorings, and all that good stuff. So I'm gonna bring you guys along today. And because of the coronavirus, a lot of us uh, got our vaccines. So the good news is that now we could actually attend. That's right, attend. But let me get my mask on, hold on. Now, what I like about coming over here is you can get some drinks. Look at that, what drinks do you want to get? Ooh, Diet Mountain Dew. That's right. All right, so our dis design studio is actually with Ashley. Hey, how you doing? Good. Oh, I came here to steal some drinks. Okay. <laughs> Anything else? Yeah, I'm actually uh, waiting for my clients over here. Ashley okay. and... Right here. I'm here, guys. <laughs> I made it. Out there out front, and then as you make your way towards the front door, you're going to have a recessed cam light centered overhead there. And then you're also going to have a power outlet there with your doorbell button right there. So what we're doing now is we're actually picking uh, high and low voltage with the electrical. This is like one of the most crucial parts when specking out your home. Now, if you ever decide to add a pool, now is the time to add the pool. Make sure it is a 220 with a 50 amp. The base cabinets extending from the kitchen into the nook area. Covered patio three, so the full length. Um, gas stuff at the back. Laundry sink pre plumbed So you said there was a microwave somewhere? It's over. Um, before I give you pricing on it, there's a couple things I want to talk about. Included in the kitchen, you'll have the 42 inch upper cabinets. So they'll be this exact same height in here. Um, the molding piece at the top is half the size of this one. This is two inches. You'll have a three quarter inch. Now we're going to go take a look at some hardware for the cabinets. Yeah, it looks like you guys got rid of a, a bunch. Yeah, we got rid of some, uh, but we're replacing them with others. We just, uh, the cabinet guys haven't been messing around. Yeah, they're still messing around. Yeah, they're still messing around. Remember, you guys got that, those bronze handles too, right? That gold the handle? Gold. Yeah, that's what I was asking her. So right here we have our cabinet options here. This is level one, two, three, four, five. What is that? One, two, three, four, five. So the ones up here are gonna be a little bit more higher in price. So, fruit for thought, something you should know. I'm gonna show you guys some of the uh, flooring samples here. Ooh, that's a nice one. Now keep in mind, this looks pretty light, but when you put it down in, in the section, it's pretty large. It's gonna look a lot darker with these woods, so just be aware of that. So I always like to go a notch lighter from what I'm thinking. All right, let's go find our clients real quick. which is this one here, or just completely flat. This is what was in the kitchen, where it was at. This is the stuff that you're saying if it, if water gets in it, it can warp? Yes. Okay. You can't put it in the bathroom. So are you thinking lighter, darker? Lighter. Okay, we can pull that out. So with the cabinets, there's also pictures on the back showing variation. Yeah, we probably just did a price on it because I was thinking about the herringbone. I can't do the herringbone on a vinyl. Oh. But it does add a lot. Yes. A lot of labor. <laughs> and you lose a lot. Mm -hmm. Are you thinking more like a cooler gray tone? 
Do you like this? Yeah, I like that. Um, I think the difference between these, the tile, too brown. It's too brown. Yeah. Is these are are these snapped together? Or they are. Down? They're click. They're floating, but they click together just like a laminate would. All right. So what we got so far here. We have two different floorings. One's about 17,000, one's about 14,000. Here's the cabinets right here, the thermofold cabinets. The countertops that they are picking. This is gonna go on the bathroom backsplasher. Let me know what you guys think so far. Is it a good choice? So do you wanna do something like decorative? Uh, no, I don't think so. Okay. I like something like this. Okay. That can do. I have a bunch of different colors. We can do this in, or we can do the dark one too. So this is going to be the floor for the bathroom, backsplash with a stagger. Now we need to decide the pan for the walk-in shower. Stainless, or do you want to do? I have this quartz material. I, I can still do one. I wanted to ask you about that. What is this as far as staining? Does it stain? Scratching doesn't scratch chip doesn't chip. I have this material in my house and we've been there for about a year and a half And it still looks brand new Is it um, can you get it without the divider? Just yeah, mm -hmm. I have to this place nine and a half inches deep That's nice definitely wash your cat in that <laughs> All right, folks, so we just got done with our design studio. Oh, man, four or five hours after, exhausting. It feels like you're in a boxing match. But I think the clients, the way that they spec'd out their home, they did a really, really good job. So if you guys want to see what that home looks like, I may show it to you. Who knows? Also, if you guys haven't had a chance to subscribe to this channel, go ahead and click that subscribe button. Support the channel. Show the love. That's right. Give me a thumbs up. Other than that, until next time, I'm Chuck. It's peace. Make it some and I'll spend a song. What's the plan? Bet I get it done. It's me, yeah, neighborhood. It's me, yeah, give me some. Wifey, I see it, freeze on.